welcome to the Marcus Picks Terminal One Baggage Claim, where I'm going to give away all kinds of baggage, camera bags galore. So this is going to be quite a giveaway. Oh my God, I haven't even used half this stuff. It's just I got it because it looked cool and it was whatever. So let's just get into this right away because I got so much to give away here. First, let's start with this cute little pouch here. Never used. It's a it's just I got it because it looks cool and it's just a little too small for I mean you can put a camera in there but that's about it no lenses no, it won't even fit a cell phone but it's got all these little pockets and stuff pockets within pockets anyway we'll call this one cute little tan colored uh, pouch uh, retro pouch okay there's one and next up we have six lens uh, the, these are designed to go on a belt. So my idea was that I was going to be hiking and having all these different lenses like this on my belt because the best weight distribution is around your waist. So I was going to have a belt with all these lenses around me and I would just pick the one I wanted and put the, un, the one off the camera in there. But I never got around to doing it because I end up always using a big bag off a shoulder thing. So I never use these. So here's six lens pouches okay including a big square one <laughs> all right six lens pouches that's one thing right there all right let's keep going this is a travel i don't even know what they, what do you call this where you put your personal shaving sundries whatever has two sides never used it it's a nice faux leather <laughs> for traveling so if you like to put your personal goods in here and uh, for traveling there you go no traveler should be without one of these all right next up a Samsung case Samsung back when they made cameras made quite stylish uh, cases too so here's a nice little camera bag from Samsung never used it but cool looking so yes so here's one from Samsung, blue and tan trim. All right, next up we have this cool one here. It's a retro style, it's by Think Tank. It's a Retrospective 5. This is a Retrospective 5, small, retro colored, what do you call this, greenish colored, uh, heavy duty burlap canvas bag. And you can hold it like on your shoulder or like this. Really cool. Retrospective 5, as it's called. Next up, a really cool looking one from Nikon. Got it because it looks cool. I never used it. Nice shiny little tabs here. Really typical camera bag. Got that kind of thing here. So this is one by Nikon. Okay. Next up, this one is by Rugard. <laughs> Rugard. This is a big one, big square one. You can, it has uh, Velcro tabs so you can divide it with dividers and things. Um, this is a nice one, nice and new. It's got yellow, stylish little things on there. Uh, big square one by Rugard. Okay, next up. <sighs> These are, <laughs> this is obviously a, a tool thing, but this is a two-part two thing. Inside this one, with really lightweight and put anything in there, is this one here. I'll throw this one in here also. This is uh, good for camping. It has in it a, wow, it's multiple levels. How do you open this thing? Uh, not that one, that has another level. Come on, it's gotta be, where's the main one here? Oh, there it is. Okay, the main one has a waterproof plastic, it comes out, but it's a waterproof plastic bin that's inside that one and it has two levels on top of that, it has a level in the front, two levels in the front. Uh, really cool for hiking and camping. I'll put that one inside of this one. I'll put this one, the uh, hiking camping Ryobi <laughs> set, whatever. Okay, next up. Another one by Think Tank. This is a really cool one. The reason this one is really cool is because, okay, first of all, it's got all kinds of, you know, typical camera bag type stuff in here. This one is cool because it has, okay, you've got like your shoulder strap here. 
Okay, you got your shoulder strap, you got a hand carry case, but it also has this. This is why I got it. it you can put it around your waist, and now you can just walk around hands-free, and all the weight is on right here. This is the best place to have weight for carrying. So that's a really cool one. This is a Think Tank Change Up V version two. All right, this is a Think Tank Change Up version two. All right, next up, we have these two things. These are super lightweight. The reason I got these is because they weigh nothing. Literally, like this weighs like a piece of paper. What's really cool about this is you open up the back side and you've got all your things to put your lenses or whatever it is that you have and you open up the top and you can put your big stuff there like your camera or whatever's bigger. So you've got two different ways of getting the things. The top and the side here. And it's really lightweight. I mean literally, if you like lightweight, I got these because they're lightweight. <laughs> Alright, this is a Rotation 180 Pro first edition. All right, it's the Rotation 180 Pro first edition by Mind Shift. All right, these are gray, silver. All right, next up, a Think Tank, uh, cute little um, backpack here. Very stylish, nice tan colored backpack. What's cool about this one is, Okay, you've got these pouches here, but it's really interesting inside. It flips open this way, and you have like pouches to put things there, and you got a big area underneath here to put your big stuff, and then your smaller stuff goes here, and then you have, you can put something flat there, all kinds of pouches on this side here. So this, again, Think Tank makes stuff for photography, so this is actually a photography backpack. Kind of cool. So this is a Think Tank, what's this one called? perception tablet. <laughs> so I, I assume you can put your tablet in there also. This is a tan colored think tank perception tablet uh, backpack. All right, moving on. Here we have a ProMaster green, uh, olive green, really nice, never used, um, what do you call this? Camera bag. All right, ProMaster olive green camera bag. Really nice. Really, really nice. I like it because it's thin. Like it's not, it doesn't come out too far. All right, next up we have, oh geez, where do I even go here? Another think tank. This one is called a City Walker 3.0. All right, this one here is quite big. You can put like <laughs> several laptops in there and a bunch of camera equipment, nice and big, uh, all kinds of pockets and things. So if you're serious, if you got your hand holding here, your shoulder strap here, this is a Think Tank City Walker 3.0. Make a note of all these names. All right, next up we have these things here. Uh, six Aperture. Uh, these are actually carrying things for, uh, or protecting cases for the Fresnel, the 2.0 Fresnel. Really cool, like it's padded and on the inside, real soft. I'm gonna give all six of these away to one person. If you have anything that's round or whatever, if you just like round shaped stuff. Uh, six aperture um, round uh, things. All right, next up. Uh, these are, remember back in the days when businessmen used to carry attache cases because they had all kinds of paperwork? This is before laptops and computers. Well, I was one of those nerds. I bought these cases, I never used them, they're just collecting dust. They're really cool, makes you look like a businessman. They have all kinds of pouches inside of pouches, different sides here, look at all these different sides. Boy, look at, look at all these compartments here. Look at all that. All right, so this is a Swiss Army um, attache case. All right, so here's one of these. There's another one by Alienware. All right, this one here is brand new, but it's been collecting dust. I didn't even clean the dust off yet, but this is a really cool one. It's got like, it says checkpoint friendly. <laughs> um, all kinds of, it's got Alienware uh, tags and things on it. This is, Alienware makes computers. So this is right out of Silicon Valley. If you want to look really cool, science fiction-like, here's an Alienware 
attache case. It's all kind of like got padding on the front there. All right, next up. Here's an Edelkrone backpack. Never used it, obviously. It's still got the paperwork in it. So this one here is, uh, it's a backpack. It's a really long one. See, this is a really long one here. This is a, you can put a lot of stuff in this. This is an Edelkrone backpack. And um, inside this is, let's see here. Ta-da! Wow! Look at all that! Look at all the camera gear you can put in there. So here's the Edelkrone backpack. All right. Really, very well made. Next up, we have a big giant Arco, whatever this is. Uh, it's a green, army green, heavy duty. Uh, look at that. This is a... This is a really nice Arco heavy duty case. You got things on the front here. All right, so this is a Army Green Arco heavy duty. It's got all Look at this. You can put you can put half your photo half your studio on this thing. All right. Next up. Uh, here's a cute cute little one by um, Atomos. It's got an atomic logo on there. It's white white trim. It's a nice case for putting stuff into. Has two sections here. Oh, still got some plugs and stuff. Anyway, this is an Atomos case. Really nicely made with an Atomic logo on there. All right. Next up we have, here's another Atomos case. This is an Atomos accessory kit. Heavy duty. I don't know which side it opens on. I guess this one. Um, all right, you can put anything in there. Heavy duty rugged case by Atomos. That's very manly. If you like manly stuff, there you go. All right, now we have a, oh geez, I don't know what this is. It's red, black with red trim. Um, very lightweight. You can put anything in here. Oh, it even comes with a little toolkit of some kind. I'll keep that in there, what the hell. Uh, <laughs> all right, so this is a, you can put whatever you want here, but it's very lightweight. Uh, I'll call it uh, black red trim with toolkit. <laughs> all right, next up. Here we have another backpack by Think Tank. This one is, look at how cool that is, blue trim and everything. This is a Streetwalker hard drive is what this is called. All right. Look at that, never used. Uh, Think Tank Streetwalker hard drive um, backpack. All right. That's a really cool one. All right, next up. Uh, here we go. I, uh, Aperture. This came with a 120D Mark II, I believe. Really cool case. All kinds of things you can move around in here. This is a really cool carrying case. Got thing on the front here. You have a, uh, there you go. You got the front section. This is an Aperture black with red trim, 120D Mark II uh, case. All right, next up, another uh, Think Tank a backpack. They have all, Think Tank has all kinds of backpacks. This one is called an airport accelerator. This is the airport accelerator. And it has, of course, sections. It has, look at that, flaps within flaps within pockets. It's got another one on the front here. And then you have your photography. Uh, photography, uh, things which you can move around in there. So this is a Think Tank Airport Accelerator. All right, next up. This is a... Um, a Think Tank Airport International version 2.0. This one has expandable uh, uh, handle thing. It's a two-wheeler. Really well made. Really, really well made. Uh, and this one, this is what the inside looks like. Heavy duty. It fits in your overhead bin. You can put however many dissections and dividers you want in there. And... Uh, it's really well... Look how quiet those wheels are. Think Tank 
International version two. All right, next up, here's, a, here's another one. What is this? Uh, it's another one by Think Tank. This is called Airport Security version three. That's what this one's called. It's a two-wheeler, has the, the handle, just like the other one. This is called the Think Tank Airport Security version three. Inside, oh, this one's brand, look at that, brand new. I haven't even used this one. Really nice, okay, so all kinds of things you can do with this one. Show the whole thing from a distance. So look at this. All right, this is the airport. Think uh, airport security version three. Next up, another think tank, I believe. What is this? No, this isn't a think tank. It looks like it, but okay. This is a backpack. I don't know what logo it. What? It says professional, but oh. it doesn't. Oh wait, here it is. Tamrack. This is a Tamrack uh, camera bag. It says professional on there. So you you use this, then you will be considered professional, I guess. It has a main area on the top. Uh, where you can put your cameras and stuff. It has like a, a clear pouch here. So that's the top area. And then the bottom area, you have all your sections. So that's kind of like, a, this is a more heavy duty version of those two silver ones I showed you earlier. But this is heavier, a little bit, than the silver ones. Um, this is a backpack, Tamrac Professional backpack. And it has side pouches too. Look at that, oh you can get to the stuff from the side. You got like side pouches you can get to. That's really cool. Um, and I, there's one on this side. What is this? More pouches. Okay. This is a pretty cool, well-made Tamrac professional. All right. Here's one by Think Tank. This is a really heavy duty, sturdy one. Very, uh, very, very strong. I can't uh, describe to you how, e even the lid. This is a strong lid on here. It's actually called a Video Workhorse 19. This is a Think Tank Video Workhorse 19. So if you want something very strong and protective, this is not a soft case. This is a hard case that looks like a soft case, but it's pretty, it's very hard. So uh, this is a Video Workhorse 19. It has, oh wow, it has a handle here um, and a front pouch here and a handle on top. And of course, a carry strap for your shoulder. So that's that one. A couple of weird things. This is a stylish uh, messenger pouch, I guess you could call it. Uh, this is a, it's got a handle this way and a, and a shoulder strap. I bought it because it looks cool. <laughs> All kinds of pouches. This looks like something like a messenger in New York would wear or a stylish, a stylish person. Um, so this is a, it's by Cool, Cool Walker. This is a Cool Walker messenger pouch. Okay, then we have something really weird. Ah, this is a US, so this is actually a US military protective, look, look at the inside here. This is actually uh, protected with padding. This was used in the Vietnam War for fighter pilots to have their, their helmet on there. This is an actual pilot's, uh, case. His name was Musser, J.E. Musser. That was the guy's name. I'm keeping the helmet, but I'm giving away the bag because it's so cool. This is a really cool uh, military bag and it has very lightweight pouches, one in the back here and one in the back here that you can put big giant bags you can put like all kinds of crap in. And then it has two pouches inside, which is really cool. You got little pouches inside here. And it's padded and it's lightweight and it looks cool. So this is a uh, military helmet bag for a fighter pilot. All right, so um, look at this stuff. This is the, the Marcus Picks baggage claim Terminal 1 stuff. All this stuff's being given away. Oh my God, we have so much stuff here at the, at the airport. All right, well, uh, get to it. MarcusPicks.GiveawayEnter.com is how you get to the website. Fill it out and uh, we'll give it away as soon as we can. MarcusPicks.GiveawayEnter.com. See you in the next video. Until then, have a good flight.